we would have to take care of the Singaporeans and this is where everything being the same even something are not totally the same we will tell the company sorry keep the Singaporeans for the foreign workers that you want to keep uh, share with us what special skill set that this person have that we don't have that you need to keep the person so typically I give you an example if uh, there's a uh, I mean when we look at retrenchment this right company tell us that okay I will need to send maybe 15% of the workers away because there's excess of 15% we will have to look at uh, the configuration of how this 15% will look at so in the department let's say I'm in the I'm a tooling department the tooling department, we will first ask how many workers do you have there? So they may have uh, maybe 30 workers. How many are locals? How many are uh, uh, foreigners? Um, cannot be more than, can, you cannot have more foreigners than Singaporeans. I think we should know. Uh, of course, if you, uh, because there's some quota already. So let's say data loss that there's uh, 20 Singaporeans, I only have 10 foreigners. So by virtue that there's already 10, I mean, uh, and if they, if they choose to remove really some of the locals are uh, this is where we go down to each individual what are the skill set that the guy have that we don't have and why are you keeping the foreigners so we go into such scrutiny uh, to work closely with the company because we are answerable to our people in the end so this is something that we have been doing actually in peace time we have to ensure that all employees are protected at the same time because uh, some of the foreigners are also our members we also have to make sure that we take good care of them that their well-being are taken care of